Hello and welcome to third part of Synthetic Data Pipeline in IsaacSim. Here I am going to show how to record synthetic data in IsaacSim. As optional steps, if you want to record semantic segmentation and bounding box data, you'll have to make sure that the semantic information is added to your simulation environment. Check out part 1 of the Synthetic Data Pipeline tutorial series where I show how to do that. Also, if you want to add domain randomization to your environment, check out part 2 of the tutorial series. IsaacSim also offers Python APIs to add semantic information and domain randomization to your environment. My environment is already set up with semantic information and domain randomization. So let's record some data now. First, I'll enable Synthetic Data Recorder tool, then enable the sensors and output format in sensor settings. After that, you can press play and start recording. However, I'll add one more viewport before recording data. Create a new viewport window from window menu option and dock it if you want to. Next, for the newly created viewport, I'll create a camera and adjust its viewpoint. You will see sensor settings corresponding to both viewports in the Synthetic Data Recorder tool. I'll record RGB, depth, and instance segmentation data from the left viewport and record RGB and 2D bounding box from the right viewport. I'll also change the capture period to 1 so that Synthetic Data is recorded every 1 second. Then you can press play and start recording. The recorded data will be available locally in the output directory specified in the recorded settings. Now let's look into the recorded data corresponding to both viewports. For the first viewport, here is the RGB output. Next, let's look into instance segmentation data. You have access to the output as NumPy array as well as visualize them. The same applies to depth output. Here is the RGB output from the second viewport. And that's how you can record synthetic data in IsaacSim.